A distinguished Providence, Rhode Island middle school, originally built in 1929, was recently reborn after closing for five years because of growing structural concerns. Nathan Bishop Middle School was entirely gutted and reconstructed in a $36 million renovation project and reopened in the fall of 2009. The new school comes with a brand new, extremely comfortable and quiet HVAC system featuring Taco supplied advanced hydronic equipment. The school recently had underwent a $36 million renovation where all mechanical systems were completely updated. The comfort level of the school since the renovation has been improved in the sense that we now have consistent heating temperatures in the winter and consistent cooling and air conditioning building-wide in the summer. The system was designed by Griffith & Very Inc. of Wareham, Massachusetts. The project came in under budget for the mechanical and plumbing work and achieved its design objective of exceeding the requirements of the Rhode Island Energy Conservation Code. Taco recently talked with Wayne Matson of Griffith and Vary to discuss the project. The original school had, uh, was featured for HVAC, an old hot air system which consisted of uh, two giant blowers, steam coil, and a tunnel system. Chill beams were, um, were a perfect application for this project because they're a very simple device, they're very easy to understand, they're very quiet in classrooms, uh, the amount of air that needs to be supplied to them is a lower quantity than typical VAV systems and they just provide a very comfortable um, atmosphere and environment at a low energy cost. The primary air that goes to the induction units or the active chilled beams comes from two custom energy recovery units, also known as dedicated outside air units. These units were built up in place um, in a, in a sub-basement mechanical room and there's an extension of ductwork that runs from these units, runs throughout the school and provides the primary air to those induction units, as I've said. One of the things that you notice on this project in the mechanical room is that all the hydronic equipment, the pumps, air separators, expansion tanks, triple duty valves, and those types of accessories are all manufactured by Taco. Uh, we, as engineers, have been specifying Taco for a good number of years. They've been very reliable, have never had a problem with it. And the folks at Emerson Swan uh, stand behind the product and provided excellent service. In, in this project, we chose the Taco pump specifically because that line of pumps is very flexible, they fit the application very well, they fit in this mechanical room, and they performed exceptionally. Making the school chips verified was also a primary objective when creating the system. Nathan Bishop is now one of two chips verified schools in the capital city of Providence. Maintenance of the system and school operations is now under the control of Aramark Education. Taco talked with facility manager Dave Gaudet about the new Nathan Bishop Middle School. We're at the Nathan Bishop Middle School, which is a CHIPS verified building. That stands for the Collaborative for High Performance Schools. Over the years, a lot of city building codes have progressed towards very energy efficient designs versus past years. So it's really a challenge to go above and beyond that. Some of the unconventional systems are, for instance, we use rainwater that we collect in a big tank outside and we treat it with some um, biocides to make sure that there's no germs in it. And we actually use that um, for gray water systems in the building, like our cooling towers and our commodes and bathrooms. Because of the limited mechanical space in the building, we had to resort to a vertical pump design. And Taco was very instrumental in helping us select the right equipment to save that space in the mechanical room and still perform the way that we needed it to. The state-of-the-art control systems allow us information at our fingertips if there are any alarms or conditions that we need to address and it helps us maintain the building better and keep everything up to par as far as the way it is operating. <laughs>